All right, welcome back. I still have Peridy Bilo, the crooner of Godwin in the studio with me. Um, and the brother of whom you have a crush on. Creed, I think it was a matchmaker and your brother, but you, you know, have to you add can that. Relax. You said it, you, 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 you put yourself out. Already. Okay, so Creed, if I'm crushing on his brother, it's fine. Let's roll with it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> let's rub minds with it. Let's rub minds with it. <laughs> mm, I like that. Okay, now let's talk about. No, my producer, oh, everyone yeah. knows that Creed Bilu has a lot of female fans. Not just older female fans, younger female fans. I don't want to give a lot of people away, but we know that <laughs> you have female fans swimming everywhere. What has been your most interesting encounter with, a female, with any female fan? Ooh, um, that is a, that's a bit tough because um, every encounter I have with my beloveds is always a beautiful experience. No, not a beautiful experience, not a shocking one. I shocking want the juicy one. The juicy, like, what do you mean juicy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't want to give it away, so just uh, tell me anyone that was memorable. Um, okay, um, they usually want me to sign at uh, weird places mm -hmm. uh, sometimes. And um, most, like, every time, yeah, that um, I meet, like, a real fan, like, just screaming, like, screaming, like, in a public place, I, sometimes I feel like, oh, what's going on? Tell her to calm down. Tell her to calm down. <laughs> yeah, but, I mean, but um, it's always beautiful. Every, every individual experience is different, and it's so much... Um, um, Inspiring. Okay, actually. so you want us to believe that you're still shy yeah. and oh my god, can you guys relax? That's what you No, do. I want you to believe that I love my fans and I appreciate them very much. Mm, okay, but sometimes you get scared. Trust me, yeah, I do. Okay, all right. Now let's but talk. Shout out to them, bro. Shout out to you guys. I love you. Okay, so let's talk about relationship status. Relationship status. Is Corey DeBello seen anyone? People are. Yeah, Corey DeBello is seen. Um, Somebody's seeing me right Don't now. Don't even try I've seen that you with I've me. Seen you. I'm getting you. Is Curry Devilo dating anyone? Dating anyone? What's today's date? Really? Today's like um, 20, really, right? really. I think, I think this is like officially our first date, right? No, we're not dating. I'm dating your elder brother. Please stop. You have Why? a crush on my elder brother, but you're dating oh. him. So I don't know how that's okay. going to well, work. Well, we're supposed to fix the date, so something like that. <laughs> yeah, but this, we can make this. Yeah. Okay, so you're yeah. hiding away from that. I mean, I'm, I'm in a relationship with God and my fans. There was reports that you're dating one of the Burari daughters. Ooh. <laughs> one of them. Ah. We oh saw the God. pictures. Oh, my God. Um, Why do you think that happened? Why do I think it happened? Mm -hmm. Um... I'm a big fan of her. Uh, yeah. So you're crushing. <laughs> crushing? Did you say crushing? Yeah, you said big fan. So I'm, rubbing you did lips, like, mm. I'm rubbing minds with her. Okay, so <laughs> Curry Bill is rubbing minds. <laughs> okay, big with, okay, yeah. big fan. Yeah. Big fan. Aisha. Rubbing minds yeah. of Aisha. Very yeah. crushing. Hashtag. Okay. Yeah. So you have that. Yeah. Okay, you have a crush. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> All right, now let's talk about another controversy that. That happened. I'm sure you know. Each Do we have to talk that. about controversies on our first date? This doesn't like. I didn't agree to that date, so really doesn't. But count. we're already is, on a date. This is date, investigation. Like, we what? can do the date later. This is investigation. investigation. I need to get everything out. Ah. Let's talk about the controversies. Okay. Godwin's biggest controversy in Which church. Is? Oh, in church. The performance in church. <laughs> how did how did that feel? Seeing the speculations of what people were saying. Um. I was not um, opportune to see everything that everybody was saying. Mm -hmm. I only got to see a few. And um, I understood that people were having mixed reactions okay. as to why um, an artist would go and perform um, in a church. Okay. But um, like I said um, previously, Godwin is a testimony. And... Um, Godwin was divinely inspired. Godwin is God's song, not even my song. Godwin is your song. Um, and I didn't just go to the church to say, yo, we're out here. No, I, I, I was invited, actually, um, by the church to come and minister, as, a, as it were. And um, I believe everybody is entitled to, to, to what they, they believe is righteous or unrighteous. But at the end of the day, um, I'm giving glory to God, mm. and I feel totally, totally, totally um, honored to be invited by him to come and sing in his house. Mm. So that's what, what it is. 
G given what was said and everything, yeah. would you do it again? I actually did it this morning. Before coming here, yeah, I was in church this morning and I, and I ministered to Godwin. So nobody's I stopping was that? Except God say, you know what, son, um, I'm dropping another jam for you around um, 12 o'clock tonight. Be ready. The melody is going to come to your mm -hmm. and um, that one will take you, you know, on the holiday from my house a bit. But I would definitely do it again if I get invited. Mm. So if you definitely invite Kori Belu to your church, he's delivering Godwin again on stage. Because All right, reasons. let's talk about, we learned that you have an initiative, the Corey Bello yeah. Initiative. Mm. Tell us about that. Okay, um, the Corey de Bello Initiative is more, it's like um, a foundation, mm -hmm. yeah, where literally we set up to help young people um, live positively. Okay. And um, also encourage national, national development and patriotism. Okay. Uh, help people to fall in love with Nigeria and um, believe that Nigeria will definitely get better. But we, I choose to, to start with my peers because I believe that um, we have a lot to offer and um, we're a new breed um, of Nigerians mm -hmm. that, um, that will take Nigeria to the next level. But um, aside that as well, we encourage um, like environmental consciousness to help people to encourage um, young people to also indulge in tree planting exercises okay. and stuff like that. Are you working with any state government? Is there any bigger organization backing you up? Yeah, definitely. We, um, right about now, no, because um, we intend to, you know, go um, steadily, make impacts and, like, um, put drop dots, then later we have more or bigger support systems that help us connect the dots, but we want to do our own um, ground works first before we blow it out. So definitely in the future you're looking at collaborating with them? Definitely, we're looking at collaborating with um, um, organizations that um, I think in that direction okay. uh, of national growth and, and development and overall well-being and wellness of the Nigerian youth, mm -hmm. um, inclusive of the state governments and um, federal government and international bodies as well. Mm. Let's talk about now the Corridor musical brand. Okay. What is, I know we still, you say you have songs that are, you know, recorded already. Get into the dates part of our, our dates, yeah. <laughs> that are recorded already. <laughs> <laughs> what is your plan for the next five years? Are you eyeing any international deals? Definitely. Um, um, international deals, what do you mean by that? You know, every, people get signed these days to Convict Records and Says, yeah, is this something um, you're eyeing as well? Right about now, um, I'm, I'm not eyeing a particular um, signing. Mm -hmm. I am only um, looking forward to um, being part of the Maven that is an international um, brand, international label. Mm -hmm. What signing other, other acts. Okay. I, um, I see myself as a mega superstar, so um, definitely the Corey Develo brand next few years would be um, international, mm. God willing. But right about now, I just want to work with Maven and help um, and be part of a, a Nigerian label okay. that uh, is a global brand. Top three musicians you want to work with outside the Maven family? Outside the Maven yes. family. Top um, three. International or um, Let me start with local. Terrestrial. First three. I like to work with Asha. Okay. I think she's beautiful. Uh, she does beautiful music as well. I think I like to work with um, Wiz. Wiz Kid. I like to work with. Um, if I had two, two faces, it sounds cliche, but yeah. <laughs> Let me add two faces to number four. Okay. Okay. Um, I like to work with. Um, who else? I like to do something. So with Asha, Wiz Kid, and Two Face. Okay, you're still in. You, you, you. Mm, that's four. I said three. Two Face on his own. So this is on his own, yeah. so chill him out. International, yeah. three. International, I like to work with Breezy. I like to work with, um, I like to do something with Ariana Grande. I think mm. she's cute. Uh, that's going to be a cute collaboration, I like to, definitely. I like to do something with um, Kendrick Lamar as well. That's interesting. Okay, so. definitely. We'll be looking forward to that. And Thank looking forward you. to what comes after Godwin. 
Yeah. Try to sleep okay. with two eyes, musical eyes closed. We shall eyes do eyes well. Eyes closed. People will say ole u. Thank you so much Thank for joining you. us. Looking forward to another date with you as well. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank okay. you guys so much for joining us in the studios. Like I said, Abel was not able to make it today, but I'm sure he's going to be here same time next week. My name is Daphne Akatsuba. Thank you for joining us on the show where young people talk like never before. Bye-bye. <laughs>